What is up guys, this is Tarong Guy, and welcome back, I know it's been a couple of days since we've uploaded an actual video, I went to New York, you know, saw some friends, saw some family, so you know, important things, because I figured, you know, we were already kind of ahead of the game, but now we're going to get back into the game, and we're going to try to, you know, keep going for that 365, I mean, hell, we're already, uh, we have a lot, we have, what, over 70 so far, I think, last time I counted, I actually haven't checked out the channel in a while, I did upload that little 10 second blurb, of a video so i do want to say let's hear what was episode the finale of our of our crystal um apparently my i don't know how to work the thing on my phone so i have to actually yeah so that's the thing that's annoying um <laughs> anywho so yeah so chris the ending of crystal was level 71 or yeah level 71 was episode 71 so that was so there are little things like what were that 72 so this here's episode 73 we are well we're past that you know how we want the 365 anyway let's just go ahead and watch the intro real quick while we ramble on so this is the next step on our Pokemon adventure. This is Pokemon Emerald Randomized Nuzlocke, and it took me a little bit to actually get this because I had to find it. Um, but now that I found it, I've never actually played Emerald. I've played Ruby, I've played Sapphire, I've never played Emerald. So I'm kind of excited, I'm kind of nervous, a um, little bit of both, because now, like, I don't know. Hmm. How to how to word my my nervousness? Um, I think the main reason that I'm nervous now is because now there's like abilities and stuff. Now there's a much wider wider world. There is Rayquaza. There's Kyogre. There's Groudon, Jirachi, and um, Deoxys, and all this other happy jazz. And I don't know. Just I I can remember getting my first copy of a third gen game, which happened to be Pokemon Ruby. Um, yeah, 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 this game can play at however clock based events with longer, that's fine, I don't care. So, no, I, so my story with Ruby is, um, I was living with my aunt in New York, and I still had a Game Boy Color, I never got, I never had a Game Boy Advance until long, long, long after this game was released, um, and I really wanted one, like, that was something that I desperately, desperately wanted, but, you know, um, I never had one. So, as I was living in New York, I was living with my aunt, and my cousin and I, we were talking, and I was trying to introduce him to Pokemon, and this and the other thing, and he didn't really care too much about it, um, he, he just didn't, he, he was not, he's not a gamer, he's not a Pokemon fan, he's farm boy, you know, he wants to go out there and do whatever he wants to do, ride trucks, whatever, fuck around with animals, um, but no, so, we were sitting there talking, because this is one of the, uh, the Game Boy uh, SP first came out, you know, that first folding Game Boy, the Game Boy Advance SP, sorry. And so we were sitting there looking at it, I was like, oh my god, this looks so cool. And he's like, do you think you'd want that, or do you think you'd want the Advance? I was like, I think I'd probably want the Advance, just because it was cheaper, um, and I knew that that was a more reasonable thing for me to save my money for. Well, apparently, what he was doing was he was fishing for information to tell my mother and my aunt. Um, and then for my birthday, I got a Game Boy Advance SP with Ruby. Um, because my mother was still living in Pennsylvania at the time, and so me and my dad, we moved to New York. Um, so I was living there with uh, my aunt while my dad worked, while we looked for a place to live. So anywho, so I got this Game Boy SP, and I remember I just bawled. Like, I cried so bad because I, I knew my parents didn't have money, and I knew that, like, I don't know. That I guess that's enough of a sob story there. Like, it was, it was my first... Um, my first Game Boy Advance game, and I was just stupidly excited, and, you know, it, it, it was fun. It, it was all good times. Uh, and then I remember I got, uh, what was it, after Ruby, I ended up getting Final Fantasy Tactics Advanced. No, I didn't. No, that was not for the... No, what did I get? Um, Advanced Wars, that's what it was. I don't know if you guys remember the old Advanced Wars for the... Uh, who lets your 10-year-old ride in the back of a truck? Like, for real, though. <laughs> all right, let's do this. Oh my god, just, I don't know. <sighs> playing through all the games, seeing how the graphics changed as they go, playing each third generation game, I don't know, it's it's awesome, I think. I, I think it's truly, truly great seeing how, seeing how things have evolved. And, uh, yeah, I don't know, it's, it's great. 
<clears throat> Vigoroth? I thought they used to be uh, my chokes, but... Oh, wait. Yeah, your dad's the gym leader who has the slack hang and what have you, so I guess that makes sense. That's not tea. Go check it out myself. And he got us a clock. Um, well, now it's 10.30, so I don't know if I should really set it for 10.30. Did I randomize the item that they give you in here? I don't remember. Um, I, I really don't. Oh. Oh, I deposited it. I don't know. Potion. That's fine. I mean, that's... I'm okay with having just the regular thing. GameCube. Yet another system that I never owned. Um, that I, I really wanted when I was a kid. So, you know. Better set it. Start it. I mean, we can have it permanently... Like, we can have it permanently... No, you know what? We'll just say it's noon. We will just say it's noon. I know there's on the... I know there's some encounters that you can only get for uh, for nighttime. I know there's some encounters that you can only get for daytime. But, I don't know. The thing said that the internal clock didn't work. So, you know, I was uh, kind of a little bit iffy on it. On whether or not it would actually work for us. Now, ooh, now I wonder. Our rival. Oh, shoot. Our, the kid who gets the raw side camera. Wally. Right? Wally? Wally Jr.? Wally? I don't know. Dad makes us uh, teach him how to catch Pokemon, and he ends up getting a Ralts. I wonder what he's going to get this time. Like, could you imagine if he gets, like, I don't know, some stupid legendary or something? <laughs> Alright, so we got, I do remember we have to go up here. Oh, right, this is the one where we get uh, running shoes. Um, my mom, if we go outside in tall grass, Pokemon won't jump out. It's dangerous. All right, so that means we gotta go down here. Oh my god, like, I, I mean, I can remember getting this game right off. Oh wait, I gotta go talk to our neighbor, right? Not the professor. Like, I don't know, I can remember just spending hours and hours and hours playing on my SP with this. Well, not with this, but with Ruby. Not about the same idea, don't be excited about me, your friend. Yeah, you know, just let some random kid in your house and then tell him to go upstairs and oh she's not here um uh, me friends with pokemon of the world that's cool um yep sweet yeah and they'll oh yeah it's amazing pokeball oh i wanted to take it be team rocket just take the ball now i know that there are roms out there where you can play as team rocket but i don't know I don't know how those actually go. All right, so now we get to see Professor Birch from a Zigzagoon. Now I can understand like a Galarian, um, like I, I could totally understand a Galarian Zigzagoon that you'd be afraid of. All right, so let's see here. So first off is a Ledian, a Parasect, or a Persian. Um, <laughs> why do we have two bug types for one? Uh, Persian's pretty cool. Um, I think I'm gonna go with Parasect though, just because he gets access to all the powders and all, this, and all that jazz. But he's four times weak to fire. And ah, crap, I don't know. Ah, we're gonna go with our gut. We're gonna go with Parasect. Gotta go with our gut, right? So Zigzagoon. I wonder what moves Parasect is gonna know right off the bat. Scratch, Stun Sport, and Poison Powder. Okay. I mean, let's just hope that we don't run into any uh, ghost types, right? Because that would just be horrible if we ran into some ghost types. All right, so that means that May will have... Well, will she have the Persian, I think? Uh, maybe I'm... Maybe I'm wrong. I need to change the text speed. It's so slow. Um, all right, yeah. We will definitely take the Parasect. Well, you're gonna give it a nickname. You know you will. But first, we have to go get a nickname from our nickname, our move writer, name writer. So give it a second. All right, then. So we went ahead and we asked some of our name writers who were still awake at this hour, and we managed to get a hold of Tifa. Got us the name Shitake because, well, giant mushroom on its back and what have you. Um, Kid May is up. Um, yeah, I think we're good to go see May. Yeah, sure. Let's go ahead and go see May. You know, we'll, we'll go see May. Do you give me balls yet? Or do I have to go fight me first? 
Alright, I guess I could definitely do this. Because that tech speed is hella annoying. Alright, let's go. So now, unfortunately, like, um, like before, we cannot actually start our journey until we get Pokeballs. But this here is kind of like a sneak peek. Because I'm not going to go fight Mei without, you know, getting a little bit of training in. I see you don't fight me, do you? No, you don't. Just to see, like, what possibilities we have. Okay, so we have a possibility of a Cleffa. Okay. Stun Spore. Pound. I oh, mean, let's just start scratching. Oh, really? Oh, wait. I think I had it. Um, I didn't check to see if we had any item. Or if we had an item on him or not. Or I guess it's her. Um, yes. Because I... Okay, I guess not. Maybe I forgot to... Do oh, and we're adamant nature. Nice. Nice and adamant. Oh, right. The Pokemon contest are in this one. I forgot about that. That's going to be pretty cool. I forgot about those. Those are fun. I enjoyed those. Oh! <gasps> There's a chance I can get a whooper? Are you for real right now? There's a chance that they will give me a whooper. Bruh. <laughs> don't, don't do taunt me like that. No, no, no. Do not taunt me like that game. You cannot taunt me like that. It is not fair. It is not nice. And please don't do that. Um, Puchianas, that's normal. Um, but there's a chance that we can get a freaking whooper that is awesome dude it is so hard to level this thing up why is this thing not getting oh right there is a town here <laughs> for the reason i thought there wasn't gonna be a town here i was just gonna have to like grind there the entire time um all right so let's get up on here all right this is the guy who tells us about the more come with me sure yeah, i'll go with you do you give me stuff potion nice now we have two potions Right, so now I can use the potions, you know, outside of, or, yeah, outside of battle instead of having to go find the thing, like, like normal. Alright, so now, what is the possibility, or what is the potential here at Route 103? An Igglybuff. What is it with all the baby Pokemon, dude? And the charm, like, can you not? <sighs> That's even worse. Especially this thing, like... Do you not have any attacking moves? Shiitake, bro, wake up. Come on, there you go. I at least want to get to level six, come on. Because <laughs> I'm afraid, I'm afraid to see what this person, ooh, peach you, huh? Again, with all the charms. Oh, damn, we got static. Superhero Pikachu. Alright, let's go ahead and go heal up. I, I just wanted to at least get one level before we went and fought May, because I don't remember if she has just level 5, or if hers is level 7, or if she even has two Pokemon, you know? Because she, she might. I don't know. I don't remember. It's been so long since I played 3rd Gen, because before, when I tried to do this Master Lock thing, I only got through, like, part of one. <laughs> I never made it this far. Um... Yeah, and it's been years since I've played a third gen game. Uh, I mean, Omega Ruby Alpha Sapphire. Yeah, I think that's the last time that I played uh, Hoenn. All right, let's go fight me. Let's go fight her. All right, so now let's see here. So now, what Pokemon are you, you going to have? Persian, or are you going to have? Are you going to have Persian? Or are you going to have Ledi Ledia, Ledian, Ledian? Okay, so you got your Ledian. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and poison powder you. I say I wasn't sure what move you were going to have, so yeah, we'll poison you just so we can get that initial or that residual damage. Oh, supersonic! That's worse than that. <laughs> Damn. All right. So as long as we don't hit ourselves, I guess we'll be we'll be good. As long as we don't smack ourselves. So tackle, that's fine. Ooh, critical hit. Quick little Lydian, huh? There we go, so getting that scratch damage off with that residual poison. All right, so now, even if we do hit ourselves, the poison take will kill this Ledian, but we can kill it with the scratch too. All right, so it looks like our rival and ourself both have bug Pokemon, so that's pretty cool. So we're, we're like the uh, the bug rivals. 
Uh, pretty great. I thought that I randomized the names, but I guess not. Or maybe that's just because it's the rival. Um, I don't know. Could it could be just because it's the rival um, that it did, that it doesn't let you randomize it. I am hey so excited to potentially get a whooper. Like I am hey, just oh my goodness, dude! If, if we can get a whooper on episode one, <sighs> that'd be so cool. I'd be so excited. I'd be so happy. Yeah, let's hurry home. That's what I was trying to do, and then you stop me. Oh my goodness, dude, I need running shoes. Give me running shoes. <laughs> um, help me with the research. Blah, blah. We get our Pokedex. Thank you much. Uh, tech Encyclopedia. Just calls it a tool. Yes, yes. All right, it has started. We have officially begun our Pokemon Emerald randomized Nuzlocke. We now officially have Pokeballs. Can you talk to me? Quit being a dick. All right. Let's see here. So how many do we have? We have five. So we have five Pokeballs. Five. We have officially begun our Pokemon journey. Or I guess our... Oh, damn. All right. You're going to give me the, the shoes, right? Yeah, you are. Okay, go away. Yes, I, ha I have a... Yeah, there we go. We got shoes. Running, sh all right, come on. Please give me a whooper. You showed me that I could get a whooper. Give me a whooper, please. Come on, whooper, whooper. <sighs> that is not a whooper, <laughs> like at all. That is a, not a whooper. I feel betrayed game. Really, we missed the stun spore on a Feebas. Thank you. I am annoyed. I'm sad. No, oh, okay. I didn't want to kill it. I actually wanted to catch it, but okay. I mean, I would, I would love to have a Milotic. Like a Milotic would have been pretty cool. So, uh, for real? <laughs> Are you serious right now, game? Really? Really? Do you, do you think that's funny? Mm -hmm. You do, do you? Well, I don't. I do not think that's particularly funny at all. I also need to get my notebook ready. You know, because we're we've started, and I don't have my notebook ready. Well, I guess I have my notebook ready. I just don't have a pencil, but I have a marker. I have a marker because I have kids, and there's markers everywhere. You know, because reasons. All right. So now we get to mark down in our our handy dandy notebook here that we didn't get a whooper on this first leg of the the thing. What? I, do I get a town map? Stop! No! Get out of there! <laughs> uh, I guess not. Anywho, whatever route this is. I guess I can go check that there. This here would tell me. Route 101. Route 101. Nada. A big old goose egg. You know, we could have had a whooper. But, you know. Also could have had a, a Feebas, but, you know, um, Shiitake decided, nah, we're going to go ahead and we're just going to one-shot this thing. All right, so let's see here. A Makuhita. Okay. Oh, can you survive a scratch from Shiitake? Let's find out. Oh, you can. Very nice. Focus energy getting all pumped up. Yeah, man, he's going to go ahead and use one of those... Uh, those fighting moves of his, possibly. Now, this is Route 103, if I remember correctly. I think. Pretty sure it's Route 103. I'm not gonna put in a number there until I go ahead and... All right, so it loves to toughen up its body above all else. If you hear quaking rumbles in a cave, it's the sound of Makuhita undertaking serious training. Um, we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna call you Zuna for the late great Yokozuna. But, you know, he's not a Yokozuna because he is just a small little Makuhita. What am I even typing? Zuna, wow. All right, and this here is Route 103, yes. Route 103, got us a Makuhita. 
Yo, yeah, buddy. So we got a fighting type. So that's great. So we have two physical types. So or two physical Pokemon. So now we really need to get some some special attackers in here. But we have officially reached that 20 minute mark. So unfortunately, these beginning episodes they do tend to take the longest, unfortunately. Um, but do not fret. We will be back tomorrow where we will go ahead and see what route 102 has to offer us. So I want to thank you folks so much for watching. I hope you guys are ex are as excited as I am to see just what this new generation has to offer us. All right, guys. We'll talk to you then. Bye-bye now.